So I hope you like the intro. It took about uh, about 15 minutes to make, uh, but yeah, this is gonna be my review of the Alienware Aurora R11, and I hope you enjoy. So yeah, uh, this is my Alienware Aurora R11. Uh, this is my review of it. I have to say, for 1,700 bucks, uh, you can't go wrong. The specs on it are as follows. I have an Intel Core i7 uh, Comet Lake uh, edition or whatever that is. I have the, for the GPU, I have the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 2070 Super. I have uh, basic DDR4 RAM, eight gigs each stick, two sticks. And I also have a, a one terabyte uh, SSD in here. It's not really custom other than it being water cooled. Uh, it took about a week from to get it from purchasing to um, to actually having it in my house. So that's pretty cool. It's got Bluetooth. It's got Wi-Fi on it, so I don't need to run any cables into it. That's pretty cool. I bought it mainly for for gaming. My brother has an Alienware too, and I loved his computer. His cut through Grand Theft Auto 5 like butter, and I wanted something similar to his, so I bought a Core i7 with the RTX 2070 Super, a little bit better than his. But yeah, I bought it mainly for gaming, and uh, I was hoping to play a lot of Warzone on it, and it runs Warzone crispy as butter. The only problem is I suck at Warzone, so I don't play it anymore. <laughs> at least I don't play it as much. I play a lot of old school RuneScape though, and uh, you don't need a $1,700 computer to play RuneScape on, old school RuneScape on. It is water cooled, so that's pretty cool. I don't mess with overclocking. I can show you what it looks like when I play Warzone, that'd be pretty cool too. So this is Warzone. I'm pretty sure, I'm like 99% sure that uh, it is in full graphics, whatever it is. Oh, I'm gonna get this guy right now, ready? Yeah, we got a kill. Yeah, see, it runs really good. Getting killed non-stop. So, I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a $1,700 computer. I think I paid $1,720 for it. I suck at Warzone, so I don't really play that much. So, yeah, uh, that's my review of the Alienware Aurora R11. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, as always, leave a comment below. Other than that, like and subscribe if you like the video. And you want to see more. Alright, peace.